forward. After staring at nothing on the horizon, but ocean, ocean, and more ocean, for seven days and over a thousand nautical miles, the wild coastline of Panama was now in our sights. We would be making landfall in the archipelago of Bocas del Toro, located on the northwest corner of mainland Panama. After all the years on board, there's still nothing quite like the feeling of sweet, sweet land appearing in the distance after a long voyage. It's really ominous. Big swells. Congratulations, we sailed from one country to another. <laughs> Seven days at sea. This is so cool. <laughs> Isn't it? Yeah. I never get tired of it. Like, look at it. It's so landy. It's so landy. <laughs> it's so landy. It's land. Animal it's very lands. jungly. Good job. Nice passage. Cool. Wow. It's not done yet. No. Nope. Still got to dock it. Yeah. <laughs> and you smell the land? I smell it. Dang, this is crazy. Yeah! Like, look at it! Crazy! It's always a bit nerve-wracking coming into a place, a new place, um, after a long time at sea. <laughs> but the charge seems to be uh, lining up, but it's supposed to be a bunch of markers, like uh, for a channel, but maybe they're gone or maybe they were never there, I don't know. There is a big old swell too from the back but it's not that shallow so we should be fine but the rainforest just looks crazy and I always love the smell of the land the land smell so we're just pulling into the anchorage here and uh, everybody's getting all the lines ready get the fenders on the town is super colorful. Well, Brian just called Lewis, uh, the marina manager. We're actually not allowed to go in there for the check-in process. So we have to anchor and then when the check-in process is done, we can go into the marina. So yeah, we're going out to anchor. <laughs> All right. We're dropping the hook. Setting the hook. Game back in, back in, back in. Oh. How's that feel, Kaz? Okay, I'm gonna call it. Woo! Successfully and officially That's a wrap. Here. Squeezing your brows? <laughs> yeah. Squeezing away in there? Getting ready yeah, for Panama? I wasn't brave enough to do it while underway. <laughs> awesome sail, everybody. Well done. Good job. Only wow. one small mishap. <laughs> and then we were slightly ran aground, but no harm, no foul. <laughs> uh, really proud of everybody. First ocean passage for some of us. Yay! Well done. Congratulations on Panama. Good job, Nugs. That was your longest passage to date. All right, I want everybody to get together for a group photo. Okay, we had two tries. One turned out really good, and we missed JC. JC's not in it. And then this one also turned out really good. We have a little JC head in there. <laughs> it's height hidden in the back. And baby Nugs is partially hidden. But if we put these two together, we've got. Like, hello. <laughs> hello there. <laughs> what are we gonna say for our Panama photos? Douche canoe. Douche canoe. Douche canoe. How do you spell D O U C H E? Spirits and Sierra's dance moves were off the charts. But before we could step on land, we need to be inspected by customs, health, and immigration. In this case, we were asked to hoist our Q flag at anchor. 
After a brief inspection and some paperwork, we headed to the immigration office to get our passport stamped. It differs in every country, but this is pretty typical. All cleared in, we pulled up the hook and prepared for the anxiously awaited moment of setting foot on land. Hello, Panama. Mm -hmm. Feels good, huh? I'm gonna plug the boat in, cool it off. I'm gonna go have a gigantic rum. How do you feel? Yeah, hot. Let's see. Thanks. What do you want to do first? Go get drunk? Yeah. <laughs> The passage took six days, 20 hours, which is pretty good. I don't know how far we sailed. I think it was somewhere between 1,000 and 1,100 miles, something like that. We'll have to figure that out. But anyway, awesome job, everybody. Who won? Oh yeah. Who won? Who won? Who won? <laughs> what, did, what was we, your guess? We placed the bet on the first day of when we would arrive, and I said 1 o'clock p.m. Saturday, which was the earliest. What time did we actually arrive at? 9. 9, 9. 9. So I was close. I won. As per usual. <laughs> She's very humble. The, the small ego on this one. <laughs> cheers, everybody. Cheers. To a good to passage. To a good passage. Cheers, cheers. And new friends. Thanks for sailing with us. Cheers, Nugs. Cheers. And you did so good on the oh, on the passage, Nugget. Yeah, she likes to do it real hard wow. for it. You were the best baby sailor ever. If Delos videos make you want to boogie every Friday, make sure to like and comment. Baby Nugs thanks you in advance. It feels great to be here in Panama. It's just, it's just a, such a relief to like have arrived and that the passage went so good and that we didn't really break anything on the boat, knock on wood. <laughs> JC would be flying out in just a few days, so after catching up on a little bit of work and exploring the vibrant town of Bocas del Toro, we were ready to cast the lines and begin exploring the wild side of Panama. Give me a little bit of slack on that spring. Okay, we have a lot of helpers, thank you. Okay. Yep, all clear. See you, See you later. See you later. Tide fit, tide fit. Good job, Ryan. Ooh, it's a bit of a tight turn there. I know, it's really tight space. Yeah. You just did a three point turn in like a 54 <laughs> foot wide space. <laughs> Without a bow press there? That would have been a bow. That would have been a bow. Okay, hey, so do we have a plan? Yeah, I've decided just to get off the dock and explore. I feel like the dock's awesome, but we were at the dock in Mexico, so I want to go out to anchor. Yeah. I think everybody's keen, it should be fun. Uh, I found this place, it's about three miles away, so it's real close. Uh, the name of the island is Bastamentos, and uh, I think we can just go and anchor like in here. And there should be some walking trails, and I think there's some beaches on this side, and it should be real nice. in the dinghy, the girls are cooking up some lunch and it smells great. Wow, it smells awesome already. Yeah, you want to come see it? Oh, oh wow. That's like restaurant quality <laughs> right there. <laughs> I was pretty proud of it too. I was like, damn, this smells good. <laughs> Film this one. <laughs> wow, that's pretty. Dropping. set real good here and you can see when Brian backs down it stretches out and then I usually hold my foot to feel that it doesn't skip on anything and I take a bearing of two lines or two things that are kind of like opposite like this and then I see if they move at all then we're dragging but if they're still like this then it's good yeah we're solid we're solid Brian sweet this spot is amazing. Hi 
Hi, Dallas Tribe. We're super excited for the holidays. If you'd like to grab a gift for that salty sailor in your life, now is the perfect time. All our most popular items like rash guards, Delos flags, koozies, sticker packs, and just about everything is on sale right now. Plus, Kaza just finished designing our kids' beachwear line. It's super comfy, durable, and best of all, protects the little one from the sun. It features SV Delos herself flying through the waves, so it's pretty cool. So head on over to svdelos.com forward slash shop. Grab your holiday gifts early. Thank you so much. We love you guys. Now back to the show. Back to the show. <laughs> oh, oh my god, look at that <laughs> monster. Jeez. Which one's mine? The one on the port side? Wow. Big guy. <laughs> wow. Oh, jeez. Wow. <laughs> That is fantastic. Thank oh, you. Good. You're welcome. Sure, it'll be amazing. Wow. Look at yours, guys. Mm. Big bite. I don't even know where to begin. I'll begin on this corner. <laughs> oh, it's good. It's so good. Fueled by our mega thick chicken burgers, we are ready to venture into the jungle. Panama is made up of about 1,400 islands, and we were anchored next to one of the largest of them all. Isla Bastamentos got its name from Christopher Columbus, who reached the island on his fourth journey in 1502. The name translates to provisions in Spanish, thanks to the island's abundance of fresh water and fruits. Today, much of Bastamentos is a marine park and is made up of forests and mangroves, pristine beaches, 28 species of amphibians and reptiles, 250 species of fish and marine mammals, monkeys, sloths, caiman, crocodiles, nesting sea turtles, and now our motley crew of salty sailors. Here we go, adventure mission. Bunny rabbit, you've seen? Is it a real bunny rabbit? <laughs> you made it. Pretty cool. Somebody's excited. <laughs> <laughs> like, look at it. There's no waves like this in Cuba. Today, we finally left the marina and went and anchored out, and we've done our first jungle beach adventure. And uh, we made it here to the other side of the island where there's some amazing surf and it's just insanely beautiful. Frolicking commence. Bonding experience between a group of people with a common goal of sailing across an ocean is something special. Time compresses at sea, and you can experience months worth of memories and connections in a short amount of time. Our little band of once strangers were now close friends. As the day pressed on and the sun began to set, our incredible day got even better when we returned to Delos to find a pod of dolphins in the anchorage. A dolphin whisper over there. 
Whoa, that's so cool. Yeah, look at that. Do you see them? It's dolphins in the anchorage. We came back for a little swim to get all the sand off and then dolphins showed up. That was pretty fun. Pretty nice beach, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you just missed the best video. Oh my god. <laughs> she was legit. That was worth reenacting. <laughs> Should I paint the picture? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do it again. So I tried climbing like this, but then I pushed Maggie like this. <laughs> 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 You're mean! <laughs> and then Sierra just peed like right on the mat. Next up on Delos, we bust out the wakeboard and go for a rip around the anchorage. We say goodbye to our little ball of sunshine, and Taylor gets promoted to captain as we continue to explore the mind-blowingly beautiful archipelago of Bocas del Toro. Are you ready? Yes. Sure. <laughs> Have you guys ever done ink before? <laughs> it just looks so bad. I know. It's been annoying. <laughs> <laughs> JC, your turn. <laughs> Wait, are you snorting it? Or no, 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 no. Snorting it. What? Did the answer is yes. <laughs> We're just refilling the ink pad, I'm I promise. Sure what I'm <laughs> I was so what concerned doing. for a I second know. there. What does this mean? I go to tramp stamp? Yeah. Yes. It's <laughs> gonna blow pretty hard. That's what so she said. said. Oh. Or she said. Oh. Or she said. Oh. Oh. Either way, that one works. That one's a winner. Official Jealous tramp stamp. <laughs> oh, jeez. It's a little bit blurry. Oh, that's so oh. pink. I brought my passport to get stamped. Oh. Now your ass? How we were getting her ass <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> <laughs> she got so excited, she broke the game! Oh my god, that was too good! Give us a snort. No, that I will not. Uh -uh. Freaking That's pin. amazing. <laughs> That's a very powerful image. I can't. Look at this sticker. Tell me what you think. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on there? <laughs> they're just, they're, um, they're hugging. So, they're f***ing. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a manatee drinking a, a shark? It's, yeah, does, the shark does not look like he's having a good time. The shark's like, no, not again. I think I might have got a little bit of poopy on me. I held the nugget and then I could smell it and I'm like, uh-oh, uh -oh. I think we've got a, a code brown.